What credit crisis? In a few minutes, I'm going to introduce you to an extremely powerful yet incredibly simple letter that when you send this letter to the credit bureaus, it forces the bureaus to remove derogatory information from your credit report, whether that information is correct or not. It forces them to remove it. Bankruptcies removed, foreclosures, charge-offs, collection accounts, lates. The credit bureaus remove it with this simple letter, and you can do it in as little what as 20 days. Crisis? And I know you don't believe me, but in a moment, I'm going to show you actual proof of exactly what happened using this this credit letter is so simple and the best part is you can do it yourself if you can type a letter and go to the post office and mail it you can clean your your own credit you don't have to pay anyone what any money crisis? to clean your credit and you certainly don't have to pay me you can do it yourself and this is the way to clean credit today if you're sitting there with bad credit don't feel bad everybody today has bad credit but most people don't know what to do they don't even want what to look credit at the credit crisis? report because they're just so embarrassed they know it's a mess so they just kind of give up and they figure I'll just wait seven years until everything drops off but until all that bad stuff drops off you almost live like a second-class citizen I know I did I always felt kind of like subpar you know I was always afraid is someone gonna pull my credit I didn't want anyone to look at my credit in and want anyone to know you know some of the things that were on there I was really embarrassed and it held me back it held me back in business I couldn't get credit lines I couldn't expand business I couldn't get loans what on a personal level crisis? you can't get a mortgage you know you can't rent a car even you can't rent an apartment you can't get credit cards you can't get utilities turned on and some employers won't even hire you with bad credit so you can't even function today unless you have good credit so if you're that type of person and you crisis? pretty much tried everything and nothing has worked watch this video I'm going to show you today how you can get a letter that actually works I look search long and hard on how to find a way to clean my own credit I got so frustrated paying people I just figured I'm gonna do it myself the only way it's gonna be done right is if I do it myself I found this letter I have to tell you when I found it I didn't believe it would work but I figured what do I have to lose I'll try it I tried it and it worked and I cleaned all three of my bureaus I've cleaned my family friends a credit I don't clean credit but I did it for friends and family. And the woman that I'm going to show you today, this is real proof, this was a family friend, crisis? and she was kind enough to allow me to use the results of her credit, what happened with her, to show you and prove to you exactly the power of what this credit letter can do for you. So let's get right into it. Here on the first slide, Postal Service, I want to show you that we actually sent a dispute letter, certified mail, and this is a real receipt. I have this receipt. It was sent on January 26, 2010. You see here it was sent to TransUnion, and here's the tracking number of the certified mail letter. You can go to USPS.com. You can put this number in, and you're going to see it was a real letter that was delivered. And if you don't want to do that, I already did it for you. Here it is, USPS.com. Here's the tracking number. It shows you it was a first-class certified mail letter. It was delivered on January 29, 2010 to TransUnion, Pennsylvania. Okay, this letter was delivered. Remember that, January 29, 2010. Here is the letter that we received back from TransUnion. I scanned it. I just wanted you to see that it's a real letter. And let me zoom in on the postage here. It shows you February 19, 2010. Okay, TransUnion received the letter on the 29th of January. On the 19th, they sent a reply with the investigation results okay let's take a look at what was in that letter here's your standard cover from TransUnion if you've ever disputed anything on your credit you see they have a standard cover sheet up here you can what see February crisis? 18th 2010 TransUnion the letter was dated the 18th it was mailed the 19th here's the return address from TransUnion we blacked out the information from the person for privacy purposes and this is the letter and here are the investigation results here you go Here's right here all the creditors. These are the account numbers that are blacked what out for privacy crisis? purposes. And here are the results. Let's take a look at this. Deleted, 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 deleted. 12 out of 14 items deleted. This new information right here, these are two items that didn't come off, but that's okay because in round two we attack it again and we're going to get those two items off. But on the very first letter, the very first letter using the clean credit letter sent to TransUnion, 12 out of 14 items were deleted. How many times have you sent letters to the bureaus only to have them say verified? It's so frustrating. And these are not little accounts. This is Citibank, Bank of America, big credit cards, collection accounts, uh, Capital One, and they're not old accounts within the last year, some of these. So I'm going to show you the report that we pulled to prove that to you. Here's the TransUnion report that we pulled before we sent the dispute letter. And if you look up here, January 19th, 2010 was the date we pulled the TransUnion report. If you look down here, 
the adverse accounts right here. Okay, Bank of America. We blacked out the account number for privacy. This account was deleted. It was a credit card. It was charged off. What balance credit was seven thousand two hundred forty-five dollars from April of two thousand and nine. Not that old. Deleted from the report. Okay, let's look at the next page. Here you go. Capital One credit card. I'm just going to move quickly through this. Uh, balance of $1,140. It was a charge off from 2009. Deleted. Another Capital One credit card. $2,169 in January 29th. Crisis. Deleted. Another Capital One credit card. $2,630 from January what 2009. Deleted. Here's a collection account. Deleted. Here's a Citgo gasoline card. $1,253 from February of 2009. Charged off as bad debt. Deleted from the report. And look at this. Citibank. Now, this is huge. Look at this. Citibank credit card. Let me show you the balance on this card. What credit card? Okay, Citibank credit card. The balance, $15,955. The account was closed in March of 2008. It was charged off as bad debt. Deleted from the report. Fifth, almost a $16,000 credit card deleted, and it wasn't a really old what account. Credit it's just crisis. from uh, the last year or so. Here's City Financial, $2,248 a charge off, deleted from the account. Another small collection account, deleted. Another collection account, deleted. Now, here's the first item that was not removed right here, but that's okay. Round two, we're going to attack that and get that removed. Let's move on to the next page. Here's another collection account that was deleted, another collection account deleted, and here's the last item, the second item that was not removed. That's okay. In round two, we're going to attack that and get that uh, removed. Okay, so if you add the, the, the time frame here, it was delivered on January 29th, and, and the letter back from TransUnion was February 18th, dated the 19th. If you add that up, it's 20 days. Inside of 20 days, 12 out of 14 derogatory items were deleted using saw proof. And we just sent that letter in. They did their investigation and sent it back. We didn't talk to anyone on the phone. They didn't call us. It was nothing. It was easy. If you can type a letter and go to the post office, you can do this yourself. You don't have to pay people thousands of dollars to clean your credit. What would this do for your world right now? What How much is ba having bad credit holding you back? If you're a business person, it is really holding you back. You can't get financing. You can't get a credit card. You can't get loans to expand your business, credit lines. You can't what do anything. Crisis? You can't buy real estate. And, and, and just as a regular person, you know, you can't really do anything today. You can't get a credit card. You can't buy a car. You have to go to a buy your paper crisis? lot with bad credit. You can't get a mortgage. You can't rent an apartment with bad credit. You can't even rent a car with bad what credit. credit. There's so crisis? many things you can't do when you have bad credit. And this letter has the ability in as little as 20 days to crisis? change all that for you. Now, certainly you're not going to get 100% of your items removed on the first letter. And, and you may, and some people, and all, all results vary, but you may get a few items on the first letter. You may get a lot of items on the first letter, but you're not going to get everything. So you're going to go to round two and you're going to keep attacking it. But let's say within 30 to 60 days, you can wipe your own credit clean. It's, let me just tell you, it's a different world. It's an entirely different world to no longer be afraid of your credit. All things are possible. All opportunities are open to you. What credit you can do crisis. anything. And the, and the sense of empowerment that you have when you have excellent credit is just amazing. And take it from someone that has had struggled with bad credit for years. This is the way to turn your life around. Knowing, having this knowledge, having this information, you always will have the power to clean your credit no matter what happens. You will what have the knowledge crisis. to know how to clean your credit and keep it at the maximum score to truly live the life that you want and deserve. Okay, so how much would this information cost? Well, I'll tell you, if you go out there on the Internet, there are people selling the same information for several hundred dollars or several thousand dollars. And there are companies that use this same information that that will charge you hundreds and thousands of dollars to clean your credit for you. And you don't have to pay those people. You can do it yourself if you have the information. And I'm going to provide you the instructions on exactly what to do, and I'm going to provide you the exact letter that we used with the proof that you just saw, and I'm going to provide all of this to you today for only $97. That's it, complete. You get the instructions. You get the exact letter that we used. You can use this letter as many times as you like to clean all three bureaus, and you can do it yourself. That's the best part. You don't have to rely on anyone else. And to order now, just click on the link below. It'll take you to a checkout. You check out. It's going to redirect you to a website where you can download the instructions and the letter instantly. You are seconds away from getting this information and changing your life. You can have your letters typed up 
today and mailed out to the bureaus. In as little as 20 to 30 days, you can start seeing results, and you're on your way to having a clean credit profile that you did yourself. What and credit in crisis? An entirely new world with having excellent credit. So I thank you so much for tuning in. Go ahead and click on the link now. I wish you all the best of success and good luck.